Good morning, CBBC Church family. Good morning, YouTubers, Facebookers, all you out there in the online world watching our daily encouragement. I'm Pastor Gabriel Valenzuela. I'm glad that you are with us this morning. It is a beautiful, beautiful morning. It's a Wednesday morning. Praise the Lord for that. God is so good to us. He's been blessing us with amazing weather. And then, and God does that so that we can enjoy it uh, because he created this whole world. And so we ought to take advantage of what God has done for us. And I'm just so glad that you're able to join me this morning. Uh, my COVID-19 positive for the day is that it is Wednesday. It is hump day. It's the middle of the week. Uh, the week's almost over, amen, but tonight is church, and I am always looking forward to preaching God's Word and so excited about tonight and tonight's message and just doing the Lord's work in God's house, and so thankful for that. If you don't have a place to go, come visit with us, 320 Montagna Road, Northwest, 87108, and we are, uh, the church building's called Albuquerque Bible Church, uh, but we are Community Bible Baptist Church, and we will be using that building for now and so praise god for that we'd love to see you we have services at 6 30 if you want to attend make sure you comment your covid positive 19 for the day at uh, uh on your on the comment section just go ahead and keep it positive no negativity we want to get through this time with nothing but positivity because there's so much negativity in this world that uh we don't need to add to that uh we are to be uh children of the light and i'm going to talk about the light today but we're to be children of the light we're to distribute that light as well as it is distributed to us and so the word of god says this in psalm 96 and verse number 13 the bible says uh the the bible says oh i'm sorry i got the wrong verse <laughs> the bible says in psalm 97 in verse number 11 psalm 97 in verse number 11 light is sown for the righteous and gladness for the upright in heart you know what really blesses me is that the lord knows what this world is like the world knows how dark this world is it knows how much negativity as i was talking about there is in this world it knows all of the things that are going on in this world and god sows light for you and me for those that are believers for the righteous those that walk with uh, the Lord's will and, and follow God, uh, God places light in front of us so that that way when we're walking, we're not walking in darkness because we are children of the light and God sows light in front of our paths, in our directions, in our life, every aspect of it, God is always providing light. And the Bible says light is sown for the righteous. If you are a believer today, let me encourage you that you don't have to walk in darkness. You don't have to live as these others would live in the dark times. You can be a light and walk in the light as God has commanded us. How do we do that? Well, we live our faith. We show the world what we believe in, how we believe, what it is that we know it's going to happen. Not what we think, but what we know is going to happen. And we know this, that we can always trust God, that we can always believe on the Lord to take care of us, to provide for us, even in a COVID situation time. God has always provided and God has always been there for us. God will be there for you. If you're not saved, let me encourage you to accept Christ as your Savior so that you can then start walking in light. Before I got saved, I walked in total, total darkness. I couldn't see in front of me. I didn't know where I was going because I was a child of darkness. I was not a child of the light. But once I got saved, God illuminated this world for me to see it for what it really is it is a dark world but with jesus in it we can light up the world make sure you shine your light if you're not saved this uh morning why don't you accept christ as your savior so you can live in the light you say pastor i don't know how to do that how do i do that well it's simple if you'll close your eyes and you'll pray this prayer with me if you say dear lord i know that i'm a sinner i know that you died on the cross for my sin i accept your payment jesus on the cross for my sins Please forgive me of my sins in Jesus name. Amen. Simple as that. If you've said that prayer, you've accepted Christ as your savior and you've really meant it with your heart. The Bible says that you're saved. Praise God for that. You'll no longer walk in darkness because the light is sown for the righteous and you will be one of the righteous children if you follow after the Lord. And the Bible says, and gladness for the upright in heart. You know, we have joy and happiness in our heart when we're serving God and when we're living for Christ. Are you happy today? What are others seeing in your life? Are they seeing sadness? Are they seeing, uh, are they seeing worry? Are they seeing a person who is 
uh, concerned or do they see somebody who's just excited about the Lord all the time, regardless of the circumstances? Make sure you be a light to this world. Let the Lord shine the light for your path as he always does. I hope you have an incredible day. Be blessed today. I hope to see you tonight in church. Uh, and just look out for our messages. We'll be, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, CBBC Albuquerque, uh, or you can like and share us on our Facebook page, Community BB Church. Thank you for tuning in. I appreciate you. God bless you. Have a great day.